SUNY Plattsburgh officials have reached out to support an African American student whom both they and police say is a victim of racist abuse. Local 22's Mike Hoey is live now in the studio tonight with more. Mike? Well, Lauren, SUNY Plattsburgh President Dr. Alexander Yeti has tweeted they've provided the student in question a safe new place to live. This is after apparently being subjected to racially motivated harassment. A black SUNY Plattsburgh student called the Plattsburgh City Police Thursday afternoon. He reported being yelled at and threatened by another man whom we're told is 27-year-old Dustin Ormsby. The student reportedly captured cell phone video of threatening comments from Ormsby, including racial slurs. Investigators have arrested Ormsby for second-degree aggravated harassment, a misdemeanor. A lot of students here feel unsafe and like... We pay to go to school here as black students, just like all the white students do, but we're not offered that same sort of protection. Daniela Raymond tells us this happened outside the Phi Beta Sigma house, an historically black fraternity. She adds the alleged victim is a brother of Phi Beta Sigma, and Ormsby lives next door to the frat house. Now he's out. What is he? He's literally still living next to him, so they really didn't do anything at all. Two white students say quite a few people on campus are sad and disgusted. I do know that it has hurt the community here and that um, a lot of students are, like it's really weighing on their hearts. I am deeply ashamed that this, this still happens in New York and even still in America to this day. Uh, I thought things have changed since we're in 2022, but clearly it just hasn't. Raymond says she's well aware of that. This won't be the last time that it happens. I know that before I graduate, there will be at least a couple more incidents that happen. SUNY Plattsburgh's Center for Diversity, Equity and Inclusion is looking into the matter. They and the Plattsburgh PD declined to be interviewed. We also reached out to Dr. Alexander and Yeti's office, but did not hear back. The Plattsburgh PD did say today, though, Dustin Ormsby has been arraigned and released on his own recognizance. Uh, Daniela Raymond referred to that. It's also not clear yet tonight when Ormsby might have to go back to court. Live in the studio, Mike Coey, Local 22 News. Mike, Burlington police are hoping to track down the person responsible for the third gunfire incident of the year. Police are